EFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. On this last day of November, November the 30th, Thursday, this is the Tiger Financial News Network, 10 o'clock. Market update, Dow's up 277 at 35,708, really helped by CRM. There was a moment yesterday where it looked like it wanted to do, just have a little digestive phase. It would have had, except uh, CRM trading right now, Salesforce up 17, it was up much more. It was at 250, 250. Yesterday it was tootling around in the 220s. Very big move. So the Dow... Uh, extended higher. The S&P, this is a little different here. The S&P was starting to weaken. And we're looking at it up uh, 60 cents at 45.51 right now. Uh, this is a peak E, but you see the way that the market started, the, the technical started to dip a little bit. The 9 is still very strong over the 14. But we are looking at some kind of stalling motion right here. Leg E, probably a peak E today. The Qs are the same thing. Look, the QQQ. Uh, fantastic move since the October lows, uh, 342 35 to 393 uh, the other day. And yesterday it pops a little high, it goes to 39414. Uh, Pulling back a little bit here, peak E, and I like to do the measurement from the left side to the right side where that peak D was in the E. You can see the MACD was dipping a little bit, stochastic pulling back, still very strong at 84%. I'm watching these really closely. IWM, the Russell 2000. Um, holding quite nicely up 87 to 179, 83, right on the 200 period moving average. Now, we've got to watch this. This is gold. You remember yesterday, for a couple of days, I've been talking, actually, not for a couple of days, for weeks and weeks, I've been saying the dollar, so the gold is down 10 at 2056 at a peak D, possibly a peak D right here. Um, but this is really the issue as far as I'm concerned. I said, that the low that was made back in August the 30th, let me see if that's correct. I'll do this in my show. But that low was my target price to the downside in the 102s. We went there yesterday and we turned around. We've got a nice move to the upside. So I'm anticipating that the dollar has a little bit of a bounce to it. Um, we'll see how far it goes as gold pull, pulls back. And even if you look at the U.S. Um, the, the uh, bonds, bonds are pulling back here, down almost a point. I'll be back in a moment. We'll talk about all these different aspects and what I think is going on here. The crude oil is at the 200 period moving average. Dow is up 253. Dow is down. Uh, the S&P is now down negative, almost three. I'll be right back. Basil Chapman, Tiger Conditions Hour coming up. 